Hello everyone, peace be with you and thank you so much for being here at the Galaxy with God Love Notes. If you're new here, welcome. All right, I'm going to get into the energy of the card and see what Spirit wants us to learn today. Holy Spirit Divine, my ancestors from the highest white light, my angels, my guide. Holy Spirit, give me the message that I'm supposed to see today. Give me the cards that we're supposed to see today for the collectives. What do I say to my collectives? What would you like me to talk about? What else would you like to share with us, Holy Spirit? Any additional message? Give me the cards that best describe my, the energy. Thank you. Give me the, a few more cards, please. Holy Spirit. Give me the cards that best describe the energy I'm supposed to speak about. Okay. All right. Um, what I'm getting from these cards, this card said, I was met by so many loving people. I see all your thoughts. I wish I had told you more often how much I loved you. There's someone in your energy who wish or wishes that they would have told you that they loved you. That person could be in your present, past, or maybe for your future. But a person said, I see all your thoughts. Could be mirroring your energy some way or another. That person could have met so many loving people. But they didn't tell you how they feel about you. They're trying to read your thoughts. They may be able to read your thoughts. Because... Um, they may be connected telepathically to you, so they may be able to understand what your thought process is. Holy Spirit, any additional message? Not sure why the person was not able to tell you more, but what I'm sure is that they wish they had to tell you. Yes, it was my time to go. Obviously, this person had walked away from you. They walked away because it was their time to go. I'm not sure why they had to go. And they are asking you to remember them by the happy moments that you both were, you both created. It is so sad. This energy is so heavy. Remember me by the happy moments we created. So it was their time to go. I'm not sure if the person passed um, maybe to the other side. Or that person is no longer in your life. You're not in contact with that person anymore. But they want to let you know. They wish they had told you that they loved you much more. Just remember them by the creative memories and the happy times that you both spent together. Wow. Hmm. So that person, this card says, life is a series of choices choose love so i guess this person had chosen different choices than love this person chose a different path and did not follow their heart life has different choices but they did not maybe choose love yeah wow holy spirit any additional message any additional message from these cards thank you Said I had to leave that way. I had to leave that way. So this person maybe depart this life, had to, you know, suddenly move away from you. Maybe it could be a death, or it could be that someone step out of your life unexpectedly. This person really regrets the day they didn't tell you how they really feel. Yes. Spirit is saying it is okay to miss a person because tears cleanse the soul. 
it is okay to cry it is okay to cry tears cleanses the soul and it, it not only cleanses the soul it actually frees your mind it free your mind so it is okay to cry but don't dwell on the hurt for too long just know that this person for whatever reason they had to go is for the same reason they could not stay <laughs> It was their time to go. Holy Spirit, any additional message? Any additional message? Hmm. What other message? Yep. Person was saying, um, I'm much better now. So I'm not sure if someone had crossed over on the other side, but they had. They are saying that they had to go. Oh boy. Yeah. So even though they they are gone, they want to let you know you have nothing to be guilty about. It's just a learning lesson that you have been through. This is just a lesson. So take the lesson, learn because as we as I said in one of my other video, Earth is your school. So now the person is with maybe could be with a, with another family. Or could cross over and be with his divine family you could take it as it resonates but you could have animal you could be a lover of animals you could love animals um, cats birds dogs yeah you could maybe have a big German Shepherd or a big husky you could have a poodle you could have you maybe love animals yeah so it is okay to cry. It cleanses the soul. It cleanses your soul. So we are here to learn. But keep in mind, I will always the person who passed over or moved on, they said they will always point you in your in the right direction. So don't be afraid. Make choices. They will help your spirit guides, Heavenly Father, your angels. They will help to guide you into the right direction. Just call on them when you need help. Never be afraid to call. Heavenly Father, Holy Spirit, please help me to make this choice. Trust me. They're here and they will help you to make the choices. Holy Spirit, any additional message? Oh, that person. Oh, wow. That person maybe was your soulmate. The person who crossed over could be your soulmate or was your soulmate. Yeah. So that's why I said earlier, this person is maybe with another family. Maybe they moved on from you to be with their other family, maybe in life or in death. They could be with their spiritual family because, you know, so even though they loved you and they wish they had told you more that they that they re how they really feel about you they just had to leave for whatever reason they had to go yeah they just got to move on yeah they remember your happy moments and happy times but they know they cannot continue this way i guess um the universe sometimes i guess most times orchestrate times as to when a person leaves if the person is no longer for your highest good they are forced to leave your life as painful as it might be it it's what it has to be if i had only known when what i know if i only know then what i know now i would have lived differently oh my god this person is living a life of regret and it is so heavy on my heart yes and this person is saying there's no such thing as death it's just trans death is a, just a transformation from one form to another so don't think even if the person has passed on the person is dead no they are just transforming from one phase of life to another yes we have been together in dreams so this person could be sending you telepathic messages 
through dreams because they are your soulmate. They are your, your, your soulmate, maybe your twin flame or some connection, strong connection. Could be wife, husband, you know, so forth. But that person is really communicating with you telepathically or in your dream state. Holy Spirit, any additional message? Yep, this person, even though spiritually they could be standing right beside you, not able to see them, they could have passed on, as I said before. You're not able to see them, but they are standing right next to you. Thank you, Holy Spirit, for your guidance and your protection. Is there anything else you would like to share with us today? Anything more? Anything more? Uh, one flips, but I'm not sure which one. Yeah person saying it is beautiful where I am it is beautiful where I am so this person is maybe passed on will pass on maybe soon but they want to tell you that they loved you all right yep person send you telepathic messages through signs butterflies birds or some other means of Tele communication from the senses. I don't even know what the correct word for it is, but telepathically. Yes, so even though this person leaves your life, you are never alone. They are still with you because they are your they are your soulmate. They are still in your energy. They are saying, I'm not dead. They might be gone and you think they're dead. Maybe not physically dead, but um, transformed to a way where you're not able to reach that person anymore in this physical sense. You're not, no longer in contact. You don't know if the person is alive.